Hi, we're here at Planet Nine Studios with uh, CEO David Colleen, and he's going to show us the exciting things with um, Ray Gun that Planet Nine is working on. So, thank you, David, for joining us today. Hey, Damon, thanks for coming over today. So, tell us, uh, tell us about Ray Gun, and what we have on the screen behind us. Wow, oh, yeah. Uh, well, first of all, Raygun is a uh, is a multi-user 3D platform that is geared towards being a white label software platform for our customers to build applications with that go on to primarily mobile de devices, but also PCs. Examples of customers are people in cell, on cell phones doing social networking with avatars set in real world places, making use of GPS. Uh, other customers include P&D manufacturers and auto manufacturers that are doing navigation systems for cars. We still also work with our friends in the military doing things like emergency responder tracking and, and the like. Uh, mundane things like uh, our virtual earth being used by the US Navy as a portal for, for engineering to show engineering draw to share engineering drawings and uh, and uh, all sorts of uh, uh, CAD type pieces of data to their large engineering community so uh, our customer base is diverse excellent so what do we have on the screen behind us here that uh, what you're seeing on the screen is the PC version. It uh, happens to use uh, Bit Management's X3D viewer. And it, uh, we're in San Francisco at the moment, but it, this could be one of uh, 155 different city sites that we have uh, around the world. This is all X3D running. We've uh, been using Open Standards since 1995. We uh, put the first uh, virtual city online back then. and. Uh, it's been uh, uh, our mainstay ever since. Now, in this version of Raygun, you can move all around the city. Uh, we have text chat, voice over IP, file sharing. Uh, you can do things like walk down the street with your uh, Raygun equipped cell phone taking pictures and they're automatically uploaded to our server and shared with, uh, with your buddy list. Um, we have real-time video in here, uh, thanks to the good work that the bit management folks did on uh, video support. So if your cell phone supports video, you can actually be streaming video and sharing it on a billboard within the 3D scene. Okay, so you have uh, multi-user support for Raygun. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about that at the moment? Well, we have avatars um, uh, in a traditional way, just like in Second Life or other multi-user worlds. And uh, this uh, this works not just on the PC, but on the cell phone. Our, our latest version is Raygun for the iPhone. And uh, you can have PC users interacting with cell phone users who are interacting with people who might be driving their car down the street. Fantastic. And it looks like um, there's a video playing there. It's a little bit difficult to see for the users. Uh, we have in-scene advertising here, um, as well as streaming video. And uh, there's uh, s certainly people, customers of ours, who are interested in advertising as being the, uh, uh, the mechanism to pay for these types of virtual worlds. And there, and so that that's the corner of, um, it looks like, fourth. Fourth and Howard, over by the Metreon, and then in the bottom right-hand corner, it shows the same location of where you are in um, in, a, in a 2D map as well. Yeah, exactly. Okay. You can also do things like uh, type in addresses. Here, let's hop over to our our office. Oops, gotta spell it right. Looks like I'm having demoitis at the moment. Hey, no worries. It happens to the best of us. Um, so this would allow, I would see my friends and things like that on the 2D map in addition to the 3D world and know where they are, correct? Yes, and we even have really basic versions of Raygun that work with things like Google Maps, that's totally a 2D experience, mm -hmm. and Google Earth. So you can be interacting in a Google Earth interface with other people who might be on their cell phones. Wow. And then um, also, uh, you've been uh, nice enough to show us a sneak peek. Um, tell us a little bit about this here. It looks like we have um, 
a version of it running on the iPhone? Yeah, well you're seeing our first uh, beta for iPhone. We're very excited about uh, this particular version because there's a lot of people uh, of course buying iPhones these days and uh, you can walk through an entire city on your iPhone, see your friends as avatars and uh, start communicating with them. Well, very exciting stuff, David. Thank you very much.